Ayo, duckies, Andy here, and I've created a nice free tool for you guys to use on your streams with StreamerBot. So this is random media from folders. So if you want to pull a random video clip or a random sound or song or a random image into your OBS, this is just a really quick shortcut method of doing that. All the links are going to be down below. So we're going to grab the import code, which will be on the website. It's not on the website right now because I've done a dum-dum or Waldo did a dum-dum. One of us. I'm not blaming. And then you just jump into StreamerBot, go to import, and we just paste it in there. Boom. That's it. It's going to have three different actions in it. Uh, get random media from folder, and that's audio, image, and video. We just press import, and it'll pop them all here to the side. And all we need to do to use one of these, so I'm going to show the example of image, uh, but you can do this with a media source or anything like that. All you got to do is go over to the right and see where it says folder path here. We're going to insert the folder path there. So I'm going to go to wherever I've got my images because everything needs to be in one single folder. So I'm going to go to pictures and I'm going to use this folder, which has got all my Polaroid pictures in it from the stream up Polaroid. You can right click on the folder and go to copy as path and then go straight back into streamer bar, go to set argument, double click it and paste that directly in there. Doesn't matter if you've got the, the quote marks on it or anything like that. Just press OK when that's done. And that is it. Then we can use the random image argument. So to get this fired up, we're just going to create another new action. And we'll call it pull random image into OBS. Just like that. You can call it whatever you want. Press OK. And all we need to do is set whatever we want to use as a trigger. So it could be bits like a cheer or it could be a chat message or anything. I'll just do a test for now and just leave it as that. The sub actions, we just add, go to core, go to actions, go to run action. And we're going to select the pull random media from folder. So you can search it here. If we say type in pull random um, media from folder image, select, make sure you leave run action immediately on, press OK. And then now that will create that argument for random image. Like a set state here, it says you can use random image argument. So now we're going to add the image into OBS. So if I create another sub action, go to OBS and go down to sources, set image source file, and we can select wherever our image source is. So I've got the scene scene, and then I've got image source and media source just there. So I select the source image source. And all I need to do is do the percent sign, do random image, just like the instructions say, and press OK. Now, if I press this test button, a random image from that folder will appear in OBS, just like that. And every time that I run it, it'll just keep popping in, just like that. And obviously, you can see that the different sizes, so you can mess around with the bounding box and everything like that. I've got tutorials on all that kind of stuff. It's exactly the same method for doing it with the media source as well. Just change it to a media source input. And a really cool thing is that you can actually copy and paste these and use as many different ones. So if you wanted to copy from a different folder for something else, all you got to do is just duplicate this and just make sure you name it something suitable, change the folder path, and that's it. You can use it as many times as you want. Really cool little tool. If it's helped you out, make sure you do like the video, share it with a streamer friend, and also consider leaving a tip so I can keep making this awesome stuff for you, all right? See you soon. Put your rock over the stone.